Hi class, this is your instructor Skylar Huff. It's good to be back. So this week we're embarking on module three, your third of six modules. So we're nearly halfway there, you all. This is all about bioenergetics. So here you all will be learning about energy. Energy class will be taught to you all in chapter five. So upon going through chapter five, make sure you take your time to understand the process by which plants harness the energy of the sun and convert that along the way with water and a bit of carbon dioxide and light energy into what they need, the form of sugar, the carbohydrate, specifically we'll say glucose. So upon finishing chapter five, which is there for photosynthesis, you'll then get to the next of which, and thereafter we getting into how enzymes function. So enzymatic reactions class are reactions in which the activation energy is lowered by enzymes, ensuring that the enzyme is not consumed by the reaction and can be reused again and again and again by the substrate, as long as the substrate is available. The, and then finally, you'll get into the process of synthesizing energy by way of cellular respiration, happening in the mitochondria of eukaryotic cells. So I'll tell you, you have three whole chapters, yes, that are three chapters to complete, or across three weeks. So of course, among the way, or at least along the way, next week being the holiday for Mardi Gras, we will be out of school Monday and Tuesday. So please, I hope you've gotten a head start on things upon completing your second module. So with that being stated, you do have an extra week. There are three weeks this time, but that doesn't mean you all should procrastinate, not at all. So the three labs that are included, since there are three chapters, are as follows. So it, of course, is photosynthesis. After photosynthesis, you will complete your lab on enzyme function. And lastly, your lab will be on cellular respiration. So those are your three labs to complete. As always, your tests will be completed via the Respondus Lockdown Browser. Please ensure that you have allotted ample time to complete the test before the deadline. Along the same way, I would say please ensure that this module, meaning Chapter 5, its def definitions, including questions, Chapter 6, its definitions and questions, including Chapter 7's definitions and questions, make sure they are all uploaded as a single file upload to Canvas by way of turnitin.com as a single file. And as I was pre previously stating about the test, it is due February 25th, 2018. Please make sure you get all of this done. And I'll just say work a little bit along the way to ensure that you're not waiting until the 25th of February at about 10 p.m. to complete all of these items because it will take a bit of time. I am your teacher. I enjoy teaching. So please email me at any time or even call me in my office. Sometimes I'm, I would say from about 7.30 a.m. up until about 10 to late. And then I'm available again thereafter at about 11 a.m. And then I go into 11 a.m. to about, let's say about 12.50 p.m. And of course, I can help you anytime. So call me or email me if there are any questions about how photosynthesis works, cellular respiration, and even enzyme action or enzyme function. So have fun, learn lots, and of course, enjoy. Thank you all for listening, and have a great evening.